Salam sejahtera, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Yiling from the Department of Parasitology, Faculty of Medicine, University Malaya. Today's topic is on malaria, with special focus on Plasmodium noloci. Plasmodium noloci is a malaria parasite found naturally in banded leaf markets, long tail and pig tail markets in the tropical forests of Malaysia and elsewhere in Southeast Asia. The life cycles continues in the monkeys through the Anopheles mosquitoes and humans become infected when these mosquitoes bite the humans. Thus far, several mosquito species belonging to the rucovirus groups have been incriminated as vector for Norosai malaria as listed here. Let us take a few minutes to appreciate the history of Norosai. Plasmodium noloci was first described by an Italian physician involved in a study of tropical medicine in 1927. It was first isolated and studied in detail in the Kolkata School of Tropical Medicine in India in early 1931 from a long tail market that had been imported from Singapore by Campbell. Knowing that malaria was the research focus of Noles and Das Gupta, he then handed the market to them for a series of experiments among its natural hosts. In 1932, Noles and Das Gupta successfully infected three human volunteers with Noloci malaria. Between 1935 to 1955, P. Noloci would go on to be used as a generic pyretic agent for various diseases, particularly neurosyphilis. The first case of natural infection in a human was only reported 34 years later when a US Army surveyor acquired the infection while working in the forest in the state of Pahang in Peninsular Malaysia. This single case was followed by a presumptive human case of Nolosai malaria that was acquired in Johor in 1971. The general health view that genotic malaria was an extremely rare event Change following the discovery of a large focus of human infection with P. in the Kapit Division of Sarawak in 2004.